What's on guys, it's boy Flair with a brand new video, and in today's video I want to talk about Scare Skillet getting kicked or leaving red, I don't know which one of the two, but before I get into that I just want to apologize for the lack of uploads this past couple weeks, my computer is literally turning into a microwave, so that kind of sucks, but I do apologize, my cooling fan will come in in two days and I can get that fixed and everything will be perfect, start making like live videos for you guys, and yeah, it will be fun and dandy once that happens, so but... So, but, oh my god, I'm so dumb. But today, I want to talk about Scarce getting kicked from red or leaving red. One of the two, I'm just going to say he left red for the sake of the video, but... Yeah, so I know Scarce has been getting a lot of like bad publicity like on the live stream you're saying that he will check out your sponsors if he donates and stuff and that shit is just long gone. I know that Scarce hasn't been doing right decisions. No one's perfect on this planet. So I guess he said he apologized, which is good. I know that Scarce built like my whole entire fan base, so I'm definitely not going to give him hate. I mean, if anything, I want to thank him. I want to thank the guy. He gave me like half of my subscribers, so that is absolutely crazy and that's why I'm making this video. So, everyone knows that Scares is not the most perfect person in the world, but I know that Keemstar has been giving him a lot of unneeded hate as well. Keemstar's fans have been attacking Scares, which really does suck, and, but I guess that's just how this community goes, and people just do that. So, I know that Scares hasn't been the most perfect, like, I don't know, not like the most perfect leader, because I have no idea how he leads, I don't know how that works at all. He might be a good leader, he might be a bad leader, but who knows, I don't know, I'm not in red, I can't decide that. So Scarus made a video a couple days ago talking how his brother took a bunch of money from him and he spent it on drugs. Not Scarus spent it on drugs, like Scarus's brother took money from him and then spent it all on drugs. And then Scarus got a lot of anxiety and he was really, I don't know if he was like depressed or had anxiety or he was just down. I have no idea, but Scarus was not really tweeting very much. He wasn't really active on Twitter at all. He took a break from uploading, which is fine, 100%. Like if you need a break, I know I needed a break sometimes, like it's there's nothing wrong just taking a couple day break from YouTube or just a week because this shit gets kind of stressful trying to upload every day and it's just nice to take a break every once in a while so I do not blame him for not uploading because again he was in a very tough situation so his brother took some money from him and again Scarce was really down he didn't know what to do and I guess he wasn't really in the mood to lead a team anymore so he just got kicked people didn't think he was a good leader but the only thing that we know is that he wasn't really getting good publicity off of this what Formula and Scarce do know is that they're the only ones who know what actually happened behind the scenes. So I'm not going to make shit up saying that Scarce and Formula did this or somebody did that. Like, I don't know what happened. No one knows what happened except for Scarce and Formula. So I'm not going to make up some bullshit story of what happened. Because really, I have no idea. So basically... I'm just saying that if Scarce left red and shit, I don't really care what like team he's in, what letters he have in front letters he has in front of his name. The point is is that he makes really good news videos. I don't care again what Keemstar says. It's just really it's just a really bad situation where Scarce is at right now. And if he needs to take a break from YouTube for like a week or two, that's completely fine if he's not really into it right now. Because he wasn't like the most hyped up in his videos lately. And I think he just needs to take a break. I think the guy needs to take a break, to be honest. Like I would I would do that if I were him 100 percent But I'm not making this video because I want publicity or whatever, because it's like, oh yeah, I'm making video mode scares. But no, I'm not doing that whatsoever. I just want tell you guys that Scarce did built like half of my fan base and that he used my gameplay a total of 23 times so he, he definitely helped me out through YouTube and I can't thank the dude enough I just want to say on uh, that my opinions on this stuff is that the guy should take a break for a bit and I don't care what team he's in I think he makes really good news videos and I will continue sending in gameplays I will continue supporting him and I hope you guys do too and if you have a different opinion than me and you think he's a scumbag Go ahead, just stay, stay in the comment section down below. I want you guys' opinions on this situation as well. If you guys aren't in the sniping community, then you go, guys will have no idea what I'm talking about, and you guys are probably just shaking your head like, what the fuck is Flair talking about? But you guys, hope you enjoyed this video. We can break 50 likes. That would be absolutely incredible. We have been breaking 50 likes on almost every single video. So, you guys, 50 likes. Peace out. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand. Shining through